this week's recipe, I need sweet red bean paste, but I haven't been able to find any, so I'm going to make my own. For this, I'm taking a tin of red kidney beans and blending them up. But you don't want to blend them to a fine paste. I'm now going to add sugar. I'm now going to fry my paste. I'm going to add a little bit of oil into the pan. And now I'm going to add my paste. I've cooked my paste through. I'm now going to place it into a container and use it in my recipe. Hello and welcome back to Baking by Leah. This week I'm going to be making sesame seed balls. The first thing I'm going to do is add my brown sugar into 230 millilitres of boiling water. I'm now going to leave it and let it dissolve. Now my sugar has dissolved, into my bowl I'm going to add my rice flour and my sugar a little bit at a time until it forms dough. I'm going to take my dough making sure it's the size of a golf ball and I'm going to create a well like this and take a teaspoon of our red bean paste and place it in the middle and use the dough to close it up. If you do lose shape, you can just roll it in your hands, like so. Now I'm going to take my balls and dip them into the water and roll them in the sesame seeds. I'm now going to fry my sesame seed balls. In my wok I have got some oil, just enough to cover the balls. I'm going to wait for this to heat up to 250 Fahrenheit and then I'm going to place two balls in at a time and fry them. My oil has reached 250 Fahrenheit. I'm now going to add in two sesame seed balls. I am now going to leave them to cool. You can enjoy them warm. Thank you for watching this week's YouTube video. I hope you enjoyed it.